A North Side company is getting major help from the community after someone stole thousands of dollars worth of tools last week. The thieves targeted a business that helps people turn their lives around. Not on your sides. Ashley Zilka is live at Building Value with an update and why the store manager says he forgives the people responsible. Ashley. Kristen, take a look at this. The crooks actually cut through this fence in order to get inside the property. We first told you about this break in on Thursday, and since then, the community has stepped up in a big way. It's just a great blessing for us and to uh, to actually have this amount of support and this is a short amount of time. Support that was much needed just a few days ago. In a single night, thieves smashed a van and stole equipment. $9,000 worth of tools gone. We had hammer drills, jackhammers. Our generators, stuff like that, are really, really hard to place. Easter Seals Building Value uses that equipment to train, certify, and get jobs for people who need a second chance. On Thursday, Nine on Your Side came to the business to see the damage. I'm sorry that those individuals who ripped us off didn't make the same decision or we wouldn't be here in this situation today. Hours after our story aired, things turned around for Building Value. Our customers just saying, hey, we saw your story on, on the news and we, how can we help? You know, that's, that's, that's a community. Building Value has received almost $4,000 in donations online. And that's not counting the tools that have been donated. So, how much uh, would something like this cost? I mean, it's probably about a seven, $800, you know, hammer drill. As for the thieves, store manager David Daniel says Building Value is a redemption business. Even for the people who, uh, who robbed us, come see us, get into the program, change your life. Now, if you would like to donate, all you have to do is go online to Easter Stills. They'll be putting all their money towards building value until August 1st. The store manager actually just texted me and he said they will be putting a list of all the tools they still need on their website tomorrow morning. Reporting live, Ashley Zilka, 9 on your side.